Good morning, everyone. I arrived here last night. Um, we're in Canada. We start rehearsals this morning. And of course, I have jet lag, so I woke up at six. So we're gonna go to the gym and run. And then we're gonna go home back and do some meditation, have some coffee. I arrived last night. I did go for a run because I wanted to be able to sleep properly. But I also try to organize my things a bit better. <laughs> this was half my suitcase, I swear. Um, this time I'm really prepared with like products. Although I forgot cleanser, like the number one step of the face routine. So I'm gonna have to go and buy that. I know I'm in my no buy year, but I forgot cleanser and I've got look, so many <laughs> spots. And I'm gonna be wearing makeup anyway. So this is my hotel room. I set up my little art corner because I'm going to try and do some drawing and this is not we, this is vitamin C and I'm also going to be recording and making music whilst I'm here so obviously that's not plugged in, um, I just got out of my bag um, but yeah, let's go gym Oh my gosh, look, just before I go gym, look at the sunrise <gasps> with the snow, oh my god, that's so pretty <laughs> Gym done and I'm gonna have my breakfast. I found this in the supermarket yesterday. Went to get some ice, so that's gonna go in there. And then I'm gonna have granola with yogurt and a kiwi. And it's going to very unglamorously, this is gonna be my bowl. <laughs> that's all gonna go in there um, for breakfast. now it's supplement time so I didn't get supplements with me last time huge mistake because I just didn't feel good and you never know what you're gonna get in terms of food and stuff so I was like lacking in so much stuff I had like it was not good it was definitely not good and I <clears throat> prioritize that this time so it's gonna look like a lot but bear in mind I'm not at home I can't cook and I can't get everything that I need to get and my body's out of whack because of the time difference and like so many things you know what it's like when you travel so we're gonna do iron take that every day anyway because i'm vegetarian and anemic so we'll definitely need to take that add biotin um biocult this is a uh, probiotic that's amazing last time i didn't take any probiotics and this looked nine months pregnant for the entire tour and it hurt so no then ashwagandha that's good for really um regulating your home well, hormones hormones ginseng and saw palmetto i haven't taken saw palmetto for an extended period of time um but i've had really good things so yeah that and i think i'm gonna do uh an eye mask not a supplement but i'm gonna do an eye mask because i got tired eyes i'm also traveling Okay, see you in a bit, bye. It's lunchtime, it's freezing, um, just had Subway. It's the first time I tried the Subway gluten-free bread. It's freaking great. Um, so I had a Subway, um, which came into my hotel room to get some protein. And this is like the most random thing. But so last year, I, every time I made a protein shake, I would just kind of like stir it on top because you don't have your protein shaker and like, oh, all of this is. But get yourself one of these. It's like a hand whisk, right? To like froth milk. But look, see? got my stuff in there and then you just do this oh my god please don't go wrong I kind of almost went wrong and then you just do that for a bit oh and you just have yourself a protein shake fully like mixed and actually quite nice and whipped up which I think is hilarious so we're gonna have this protein shake and then get back to rehearsals oh 
Hello, sorry I didn't take much more footage of the rehearsals, but A, my phone died, B, it's rehearsal, so I gotta concentrate and I can't show you much of the show, you gotta come watch the show. I don't even think I have the energy to have a bath <laughs> tonight. Probably shouldn't say that because that's quite gross. I mean, I've had a shower today, but you know what I mean. Um, so I'm gonna catch you guys tomorrow and fill you in on as much as I can. Good morning once again. from the vegan gluten-free restaurant called Planted in Hamilton. If you're ever in Hamilton, you have to go. I had everything. And I brought some stuff back. This is a brownie. And I brought some stuff back for the day off tomorrow because I can. So I had a lentil burger with sweet potato fries and a milkshake and peanut butter, brown blah, 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 peanut butter brownie. And then for tomorrow, I brought back a peanut soup, an African peanut soup. Smells freaking amazing. And a chickpea wrap. Safe to say, I am the fullest I have been in a very long time, but the happiest. So today is our day off. I still woke up at half five in the morning, still really jet lagged, but I took it a bit easier this morning and I FaceTimed Sam. We finally found some mutual time to FaceTime. So that was really nice. And I kind of stayed in bed a bit longer, went to the gym, did a 30 minute run. The gym was a bit busy, so didn't do too much more than that. Came back to my room, did a stretch. Wah! And then I did my Duolingo. I'm learning Spanish, everybody. The dream is to buy a place in Spain and live there for, not forever, but like some of the time, <laughs> especially when it's so cold in the UK. I can have my little hub of sunshine. So that is the goal, learn Spanish. It's gonna take me at least 10 years. So that's a 10 year goal. Um, and I went to do my nails. Look, I feel like a human again. I feel human, I love them. Found this really nice place, Olivia's in Hamilton. And it was so nice in there and my nails were atrocious. And I was like, chess, you should save money, leave them how they are. And they, the, the biop gel that I had started lifting and I peeled off my nail, two and two of my nails, which is really not good. And I went like below the nail you know when it's like you go too far and it was way too far and it was like hurting and it looked disgusting and I was like what are you doing <laughs> and plus it's so much cheaper here than it is in London so I was like why not and you know what 30 quid just made well the equivalent of 30 quid makes me feel so much better a smile on my face spring in my step <laughs> and then on the way back I found a little farmer's market from which I bought some flaxseed uh, for two dolls, I'm gonna add to my yogurt or smoothies or whatever. And then these local strawberries, which are also $2. So I spent like $4, which is like two quid, two quid something, um, on like a little healthy bit for my day. And I'm already noticing a huge difference from last year. So last year, I did not pay attention to my well being on tour, I did not pay attention to what I ate. Um, that was not my first priority and I didn't take care of me. Um, I think I was in a different headspace as well because I was so nervous about the tour, but I'm taking care of me and like how I feel and the goodness of my body 
and everything like that. So I'm already noticing a huge difference to how I feel. I feel so much better than I did last year. What shall I do with my day? So it's about half 12, half past noon. And I'm thinking I'm gonna do some vocal workouts, maybe film a cover, maybe work on a song. Um, I'm so excited. Uh, I probably won't like do all of those things, but the whole point is that I am pumped and I am, yeah, sort of like really happy to have a day off and just go into the zone again. I could just sit and watch TV and read a book, which is very tempting, but we have goals to smash. We want a platinum disc hung on our wall this year, or at least to earn it this year, and then it, you know, be hung on the wall next year. But we have goals. So I'm gonna do my best to contribute towards making those goals happen today. Okay, so I've worked on everything and nothing for the last five hours, just playing around with logic, learning and trying stuff out and writing and yeah. So I'm probably gonna stop looking at screens for a bit. I'm going to either read or draw or just do something off screen for a bit, do a meditation and then turn down for the night. I'm such a granny, um, but it is what it is. Tomorrow's going to be another full day of rehearsals. So I'm going to leave this there and I'll upload another one of these. If you guys like it, um, leave me a comment with any questions or anything you want to know, or anything you want me to film um, or ask someone tour or uh, anything like that. So thanks for watching. Bye.